Hey there, it's uh, Monday evening around 11 p.m. and uh, just finished my first official day here in Lobitos. Pretty, pretty beat. Um, and I can't believe uh, what a uh, full day it was. Um, woke up this morning, I got in late last night and so I didn't meet anybody. <clears throat> woke up this morning and was able to meet um, all the staff here and the volunteers. I paddled out first thing in the morning and surfed for about an hour and got some fun waves. And then I uh, spent the rest of the morning just uh, connecting to all the different people that have different roles here. Uh, some people are employees, some people are long-term volunteers, meaning they've committed to be here for a couple months. Some are uh, long-term interns, meaning they've committed to be here for a year. Um, some of them are just short-term volunteers that are here for a week, and so I kind of got the whole lay of the land with who's who in the zoo, if you will, um, and really met two key players. Uh, one is Sean. She's uh, in charge of community outreach, basically the interface between the NGO, Ways for Development, and the community, <clears throat> and then Oscar, who's um, helping run a program for public health and was really able to dialogue with them and find out in their development of their programs that um, things weren't exactly what they would hoped or expected them to be and that there were some fairly substantial problems that they were dealing with that they didn't really have the right solutions for or weren't really feeling very empowered to work into um, or didn't have clarity around how to be able to navigate moving forward. And so it was really rewarding spending the whole day working with them, um, spending time with them and the communities helping to be able to uh, establish some really critical connections between the NGO and, and relevant community members, um, helping to brainstorm and strategize with them around their purpose, their roles, their activities, what they're working towards, um, helping to clear up some, some frustrations around how to be able to make things progress more effectively, um, and really in one day, um, just dialogue for hours and hours and hours, um, and work directly with community members as well. Just really interesting. It was really rewarding, uh, really tiring, but uh, I wasn't positive exactly the degree to which I was going to be able to really make a meaningful impact here. I just, I just hoped for the best and decided to give it my all. And after today and seeing what I saw and sharing what I shared, and knowing what the rest of this time here in Lobitos is going to look like, I'm really, really confident with my decision to come and feeling really relevant and feeling like the experiences that I have had and the things I've studied and the content and the curriculum that I've prepared and created in, in the past is really all coming together to um, support and serve uh, this situation, this uh, organization as much as possible. So really feeling good about that. Um, I had another uh, PM surf session, so surf for another hour in the afternoon. Uh, again, we get, got back into our uh, community interface and then some more meetings up that brought us up until pretty late tonight. Um, overall, just really feeling stoked about my time here, uh, about the, uh, the, the types of positive impact that this organization uh, is gearing up to make in this community here in Lobitos um, and just the campaign at large uh, about really supporting organizations like these to maximize positive impact because they've got amazing intentions, uh, they've got willing volunteers, uh, they may or may not have some type of funding and without some strategic design, staff development, um, accountability, uh, things like that, it's really easy for this potential um, to not really be fully actualized, um, which is a shame for everyone involved. It's a shame for the organization, it's a shame for the individual volunteers, it's a shame for the staff members, it's a shame for the community uh, that could very well be benefiting from a lot of value. And so I'm just more passionate than ever, more committed than ever, to uh, continue along this path of creating uh, education programs and uh, consulting and supporting uh, so the programs like these can utilize all the available factors and all the available assets 
and put that together in such a way that can maximize positive impact for the communities, which is the most important goal. Uh, that's the whole reason the organizations were established, is to provide value to communities. Uh, and also, in doing that, and only in doing that, maximize the positive experience that volunteers have because they will have been able to be in a real development setting, learning about um, real development principles, uh, making a real positive, valuable contribution that they'll be able to um, go home knowing that their time and their energy invested really did bring value to people's lives. So that's what this mission here in Lobitos is about. That's what the greater career path with University Without Borders is all about. Um, I'll do my best to uh, take some pictures and some video of the in the field work moving forward. Today was my very first day both with the staff and the community, so I just didn't want to get out the camera a bunch um, just because it wasn't, wasn't right for that. I just had to kind of be ultra-present and stay focused and, and communicative. Um, and, uh, and I'll also share with you, I'm a little bit tired right now, but um, tomorrow I'll... Uh, go over some more of the details of what was covered in some of the training that uh, meetings that we created this evening and everything that we've got moving forward. So uh, that's all for tonight. I'm going to get some sleep so I can surf early in the morning so that I can have a full productive work day tomorrow here in Lobitos. Um, for now, wishing you an enjoyable morning, afternoon, or evening or whatever you happen to be doing at whatever time of the day it is when you're watching this and uh, expressing love and support and gratitude for taking the time to, to watch this video and to hear this message. And uh, I'm out. Good night.